Hey dude, this is Jaden Storm coming at you from Team Shadow Strike, and this is a discussion video, and it is a it's kind of like something for me trying to maybe interest you. This video I'm gonna be talking about why you I'm talking to you specifically. You know, you're on the other side of the computer screen going, Oh my god, is Jaden talking literally straight to me? Yes, I'm talking to you. You should be a Vanguard tuber, and I'm gonna tell you why. <clears throat> First thing, guys. I very first got introduced into the tubing when, um, I guess, when I started on the downslope of my Yu-Gi-Oh! playing days. Um, I saw people doing <coughs> videos talking about deck profiles, discussions, upcoming things, trade binders, shit like that. And, I, and it was cool, and I always said to myself, wow, I'd like to do that, but I just don't know if I'd be good at it. Well... Life sure has a funny way of throwing things at you, and then, like I've told the story many, many times, I came into Vanguard, and I don't know what it was. About seven, eight, nine months into the game, I just felt, wow, this is the game that I have played in my life, that I have the most confidence in my in my strategies, and my deck building skills, and my confidence, everything. And I thought, you know what? I want to communicate with other Vanguard players around the world. And if I can help them, maybe give them an advice on a tip or a card or a deck build, I want to do it. This is something I want to do. It looks like fun. And the worst case scenario is <coughs> if it doesn't take, I didn't waste it. I didn't waste much time. So I don't, I don't exactly remember when I started Vanguard tubing. Um, I don't even know how many videos I've done. One second, let's see if it tells me. Uh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> I know it's over 400 videos. I've done over 400 videos, guys, and I've had over 400,000 tons of fun. Um, I have, I have uh, had so much fun talking to you guys and laughing and joking and making fun of cards and you know all the stuff I've done from cards that make my dick hurt, which I need to start doing that again. <laughs> um, deck profiles and pineapples and chaos breakers and all kinds of fun things i have had so much fun doing this um and there are times where i'll just be laying in bed or sitting in, in front of the tv or i'll be driving home and i'll be thinking of a video i need to talk about that i think my i think you my subscribers will like that um so you know and then there's there also brings up the topic well i get nervous in front of a camera well I can't personally say that I'm nervous in front of a camera, guys. I was in, as you, if you've been watching the Zane and Jayden thing every now and then, I was in competitive acting and speech in high school, or we called it speech and debate slash drama, and uh, I performed in front of people all the time. Um, and also, I've performed on stage for people in plays. Um, I went to the speech national tournament and. and um, recited a speech I wrote that was 10 minutes long, had to recite in my head that was at least nine and a half to 10 minutes long, verbatim in front of about 6,000 people. So it really has never, it really has never <clears throat> worried me to speak in front of public. I might get butterflies just because, you know, it's just natural, but I've never had a fear of public speaking. I had a I had a fear of not knowing how to express myself, and I had a very, very good teacher to help me do that. Uh, her name was Carla McKenzie um, at the high school that I went to, and she, she gave me so many good tips that how to ex excuse me, good grief, how to express myself, how to speak, how to remain confident, um, and just things like that. And she was so good, and you know, I just love performing. Um, I will, I've always have, um, but, uh, you know, that brings up, you know, cause public speaking, it's like one of the top five phobias in the country, if I remember correctly from an article I read about it once, but, um, <coughs> the beauty about filming a video is there's no one watching usually. No, guys, when I film these videos, the only person that might be watching is my dog, <laughs> you know, and there's literally no one else around. As you can hear, it's peaceful, it's quiet, um, which, it, you know, to an outsider, you might appear crazy because I'm talking literally to nothing except a computer. But it's it's a whole lot easier to get past that than most people realize. Um, my number one thing is when I ever teach someone how or not teach or how to instruct someone to maybe how to be able to speak in front of public a little bit easier um, <clears throat> is 
people like eye contact when you talk to them. Well, if you were looking at an audience, the easiest thing that I was taught how to do by my coach was she told me to always look at the back of the room, look at the back of the room of the wall. Like if you were like, look at this wall, like you see, like here's this red curtain right here and here's this mirror up here. And then here's this wall right here. Look at that wall. That's what I was taught how to do. And the, because if I'm looking at that back wall right there that I'm looking at, it looks like I'm looking at you, but I'm really not. Um, I'm looking at the wall, but I'm still, it appears that I am. So it appears that I'm engaged and I want to talk to you. Um, so <clears throat> there are ways you can get around your fear of public speaking or performing on a camera or even speaking in front of a camera. I simply, guys, do this on my webcam on my laptop and then I watch the videos to make sure that they were informative even though I really don't like watching my own self back sometimes it gets pretty weird um, but I make sure that they are good um, and I upload them and that's the end of it and then it's just, you know <clears throat> on to the next one but um, I want to encourage you to try Vanguard tubing um, if you're a Vanguard player and you love Vanguard as much as I do you would find yourself really enjoying it um, and you ask yourself, well, where do I start? The first video I ever made was called a bio video, and I literally just kind of told you a little bit about myself. It was a terrible movie, if I video, if I recall. I mean, all I did was basically say, hi, this is my name, this is what I want to do, this is the name of my team, and blah, blah, blah. And <clears throat> I'll be honest, guys, I've seen a couple of my old videos, and they weren't good. I had to... It took practice. I have done over 400 videos, and I'm closing in on 500, I think. It took a lot of practice. Um, but it is something I definitely believe that a lot of you can do very well. Um, there's a, quite a few of my subscribers that I think that would uh, that should give it a shot. Um, I hope all of you will. Um, <clears throat> even if you don't do it as often as most people, it's fun sometimes. Even if you post just deck profiles or maybe do a discussion over the deck, it is fun to hear other people's opinions. It's fun to ask for <clears throat> comments back. And if you're one of those people who don't like to, because there's some people who, um, when they do all their videos, they do it all down here. Like all you see is the cards and all you see is their hands. Me personally, this gets very distracting if all you ever see is their hands and them fiddling with cards. I don't like that. Now, there are some people who that works great for. Now, when I do my, my some of my videos, that works better when I'm trying to teach you certain things about decks. But me, when I'm doing a video, I like to be able to look at you guys um, because I want you to think that I'm, that I'm actually talking to you. Um, and when the camera's down here, it really – I'm not really talking to you. I'm talking to my hands. I'm talking to cards, and that really doesn't do anything for me. So – <clears throat> My advice to you is, guys, Vanguard tubing, give it a try. Um, if it's if you do three, four, five videos and you realize mm, this ain't me, that's okay. You gave it a shot, and that way no one can't say you tried it. Um, I encourage any and all of you to do Vanguard tubing. If you would like help getting started, I'd be more than happy to help. If you get start Vanguard tubing, I would be more than happy to help you out in any way I can. Um, so please let me know. If some of you out there are interested in Vanguard tubing, just let me know. I'd be more than happy to help. Maybe give you some video ideas or discussion video ideas or something like that. Or we can work something out. All you have to do is ask me. Believe it or not, I'm really not that bad of a guy. So anyway, guys, I hope this video leads you guys to wanting to do Vanguard tubing yourself. And you can go as wild and crazy about it as you want. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, and consider uh, doing Vanguard tubing. So thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thumbs up this video for me, guys, and I will see you later.